am Alexis and I'm so glad that you stumbled upon my channel. Um, I will be honest with you all, this is my very first YouTube video ever. So it may be a bumpy ride, but I hope you enjoy it. I am your average mom, um, just doing life. I would put myself in a crazy bag lady category and that's how I um, got familiar with Petunia Pickle Bottom. Um, once I found their line of diaper bags, accessories, mommy bags, um, I just fell in love. The rest is history basically. Um, they reached out to me and they sent me this new bag from um, summer 2023 collection and I cannot wait to show you guys. Got it right here. We're gonna open it together. I've only seen photos of it online um, and I can't wait to see it. I'm gonna do like a bag tour with you guys and we'll see what we think. This bag is gorgeous. It's it's so pretty. So this is from the Petunia Pickle Bottom 2023 Summer Collection. It is called the Sink Backpack in Gray Matte Cable Stitch. Okay, so I want to point out that this material right here is like a smooth, soft, buttery feel. It's like a leatherette, which they use in most of their Petunia Pickle Bottom bags. And I love that because if you spill anything on it, if you get anything on it, it's wipeable. You just wipe it with a wipey and it comes right off or like a towel with water. Um, I would say that this color is definitely that gray that they're talking about. But for me on the front, it looks tan. I mean, in the camera, I would say it definitely looks gray, but I just think in maybe certain lighting it looks a little tan but in this lighting for sure it looks great um I'm looking at it like eye level and it looks tannish but I love it because it's neutral so up here in the front this little pocket here you can see that has a snap to keep it closed and I would say look how far down my hand fits that's pretty deep and wide and it like expands. And then you also have two bottle pockets in here as well. And this material here is like a tech material, like really soft. So on one side, it's like the tech material with the pocket. So you could put like your phone in there. Um, and then on the other side, I mean, I don't know, you could put anything in here. It's like a, a mesh type right in there. So this is like mesh and it expands. And then you have all this extra pocket space there as well. Also in the front, you have this pretty D-ring. So this D-ring, you can like clip your keys on it, a keychain, a coin purse. If you have something that can just clip right on there, hand sanitizer, the, let's take this off. So looking at the back of the bag, I went ahead and took off all of the packaging. Let's take these off too. Um, it has this strap right here and this is your um, trolley area. So you can put your suitcase right in here and then just stroll it along really easy, which I really love. Um, especially if you're like a family that travels a lot. On the top, we have two D rings right here in that same pretty gold as the one in the front. And this is so you can put your bag on your stroller, on your wagon. You could even put like a um, carabiner and hook it this way as well, whatever you prefer. Um, I really like these straps. I like Petunia Pickle Bottom bags. Most of their bags have 
this shoulder strap that is padded. It's like a memory foam, I would say, and it's really comfortable to carry around all day or if you're going to be walking quite a bit, like um, how I said, you know, if you're a traveling family, you're going to be traveling in the airport. It's really comfortable material and it's adjustable as well. So I'm really liking this so far. One thing that I wish that this bag had already just looking at it is a tech sleeve in the back. I am spoiled with that because we had our aerial boxy backpack um, that we were using for such a long time and we just switched out of that to our Pooh District from Petunia Picklebottom as well. And now that I don't have that little pocket in the back on the poo bag, it really makes me frustrated because that's just always where I kept my phone. Um, if you wanna see a review on the Boxy, if you wanna see a comparison between the Boxy and the District, um, which I just mentioned, let me know. But yeah, I wish it had that, but you know, it looks like it has a lot of other storage options. So flipping back around here to the front, we have these pockets they're really deep so you can put um, your baby bottles in here um, it is insulated so that's really nice and I will say that for petunia pickle bottom one of my favorite things is that a lot of their pockets or um, like uh, cool pixels and things like that that are insulated they work really well they really do keep things cool for hours um, I would definitely say looking at these pockets that they are pretty big and you will be able to fit a Simply Modern um, 14, 16 ounce bottle in here. So simple or just a standard bottle of water or um, baby bottle super comfortably in here. So I want to also look at the front of this bag a little bit closer because you're going to see that you have many 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 pockets <laughs> so let's get up close and personal so you have this first pocket here in the very front so you can stick things in here like you have to throw chapstick in there real quick you have to throw you know whatever just quick on hand or hey you're a mom i'm a mom you might be a mom but i'm a mom um and I just sometimes just need somewhere to throw like a wrapper really quick because I don't want to throw on the floor. And honestly, that's probably what's going to end up in here. You know, we're just being honest here. Um, this front pocket has a matching Max Pixel. Love these Max, Pi Max Pixels. I'll show you a little bit more in detail here in a second but it opens up and this whole inside pocket is insulated. So as I was mentioning, you know, these Petunia Pickle Bottoms um, are great. Uh, whatever technology they use for their insulation, I am 100% on board, love them. Um, and then again, we have this pocket up here that opens, it snaps. You have two um, pockets here. Um, if you wanna see me pack up my bag, let me know. I can show you how I'm going to use my bag and maybe give you some inspirations. If you'd like to see that, I can make another video. Let me know. Um, I'll put this down real quick. So this I would totally use for a snack bag um, because this is insula insulated too. So you're going to have double ins insulation. Um, you could put like little juice box in here, some go-go squeeze. Um, pouches, you could put um, cheese sticks, you know, anything that needs to be, let me back up, anything that needs to be kept cool in here with like a little ice pack. Throw that up. And then you can put it in here and you'll have that double insulation. So I'm already loving this bag. I love that it's neutral. So if we have a little boy soon, hint, hint to my husband if he's watching, then we're all set. <laughs> so inside the bag time. So this folds open or zips open and you can fold it so you can see what you have in there. I will say that first impressions, it doesn't open as wide 
as the boxy does. I, I'm going to keep referencing the boxy because it's just my favorite and I used it for so many months. And now that I'm not using it, I keep referencing that bag. Um, the boxy opens up really wide from the top so you can see everything in your bag. This one does open really big as well, but you do kind of have to push it open a little bit, but that's okay. It's not a big deal. Um, so it opens really wide. That is a lot of space in there. Um, it comes with a diaper changing pad that matches the max pixel on the inside and the inside lining of the diaper bag. So if you're like me, you like all your things to match. It's just, it bothers you if it doesn't. That's how I am. <laughs> In the inside of the bag, this pocket back here, you can put like a laptop. This is definitely at least 14 inches, I would say. I'll look up the dimensions and put those in the description for you but I would definitely say you can fit an iPad, a tablet, and a smaller laptop back here if you wanted to do that. I personally will probably not fold this up all the way how it was before. When they come in your bag, they'll always be folded up like this and they'll be stuck into like one of the pockets. I like to keep it a little bit more flat personally, although it'll be wider, it'll take up less room. So I'll put it in folded like in fourths and I'll probably put it in back here. So it's like tucked away. Like I'm 90% sure that's how I'll put it. Um, here in these front pockets, um, I would probably put like diapers and wipes here and like diaper changing um, cream and stuff. Um, again, if you want to see how I actually pack this and use it on a daily basis, let me know. But so these pockets here are super stretchy. I don't know if you can see that I'm stretching this like super wide. So it has a lot of give. Um, on the insides of the bag as well in the corners, you're going to have two pockets. You have two pockets. You have one on the left and one on the right, hit it over there. <laughs> and this back is really deep, that. Um, it's gonna be able to fit everything that I need, plus more, I am 100% sure. Um, I just wanted to show you guys one more thing because it came with the bag or it comes in the collection. Um, these come together as a set and it is the duo wet bag, wet bag duo in checker stitch. The checker stitch matches the inside of the diaper bag and this pretty like beige tan leather material, trying to pull it off, matches the same hardware as the diaper bag itself. And I like to use these at all times to always have them in my bag because you never know, ex accidents happen or they're really good for like going to the swimming pool or things like that. But I will definitely be using this with my new sink bag from the 2023 collection. I'm really excited to use this bag, you guys. It is gorgeous. Um, this is my very first diaper bag review. I've never done one before. And so if it was terrible, I'm sorry, I'll get better if you liked it click the like button, be sure to subscribe because I'm gonna be sharing more here on this channel. That's gonna be it for it was probably a bumpy ride. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope that you guys continue to join me um, on this adventure that I'm on now. I don't know exactly what I want this channel to be. Um, I love sharing the things that I love with other moms because hopefully it makes their life easier in some way. I know whenever I was pregnant, I was constantly researching different diaper bags, changing pads, strollers, bottles, all the things because I had no idea what to look for. And so I really appreciated when I would find reviews on the products that I was interested in and so I'm hoping that I'm able to help other moms 
the way other moms helped me. So excited to use my Petunia Pickle Bottom bag, guys. This is the 2023 Summer Collection. They have this in the gray that I have, and they have it in the black carbon cable stitch. So be sure to check them out. I'll put my link down below, and I'll see you guys soon.